baby mama drama girl 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 how y'all doing what's going on dj stop the beat so i brought to you guys this video that we have to check out we have to talk about this it is so much of the baby mama drama baby daddy drama going on now from what i'm understanding the guy you see on the screen that is that girl's daddy yes we do have a father in the household raised by her daddy give it up and uh we have this guy right here um this is her baby daddy that just came from jail and he came from the jail from putting paws on people now why i don't know why did he get here he's telling the cops hey i just want to leave my thing is don't his legs walk don't don't, don't his feet Ain't, ain't it look very active to me get the walking buddy okay get the walking call a uber call a lift i guess it's broke dusty ass don't have money for it i don't know so uh let's let's start here and then we're gonna go back to old boy check this out did you pick him up and brought him here i brought him here yes because he asked me to okay and then when was that yesterday? No, it was like a couple of weeks. But the only reason I brought him down here was because my parents were trying to get him a place to stay until he found his own. Because like I said, he just got out of jail. Okay, for, for what? Uh, domestic violence. He's actually on probation. He's not supposed to be doing any of this because it's a violation, including smoking. Okay. All right. Um, did he touch you at, all, at any point? Touch? Like, did, like, did he hit you or anything? Yeah, he slapped my phone under my hand and pushed me when I tried to get... He has my phone. Okay. And my car keys. Okay. All right, who'd you get the ride from? The, uh, it was, I didn't even get his name. It was a white right guy. He just stopped when I flagged him down. And where were you guys at? The park over there I across the bridge? I was right from the park when he saw me and he stopped and pulled over okay. and asked me what was going on. Okay. All right, do you have any marks or anything? Where do you, where do you push you? He just pushed me on my arm. When you were out? Trying to reach for my, so as I was on the phone, uh, he was sitting next to me. I was on the phone with my mom and he slapped the phone on is she pregnant and take that baby in the house don't why would y'all have the baby up here i can't even hear the baby screaming and, and talk, talking and uh black women when the cops ask you what happened y'all better start acting like the white women oh god yes he hit me because it does the stigma is that black women strong y'all can take a hitting y'all can take a beating and she like yeah he hit me like it's nothing y'all better make a big scene out of this it is major if you want other people to care about it you got to care about it too hell if you so nonchalant and there ain't nothing wrong with you why would anybody else care about it you know what i'm saying and let these men know oh you hurt me oh yeah put on a damn show in front of them so they know please don't hit me no more and i'm calling the cops hell yeah don't be acting tough when they knock you out <laughs> but uh let's go on my hand phone went flying into the front where the window is yeah. and when he did that i know him because he likes to escalate things i got out of the car and i told him to get out of the car yeah. and we were in the middle of the road when this happened okay so um he decided to jump into the driver's seat and when i went to go reach for my car i wasn't gonna let him hit me so i'm going like this to try to get my car or get my phone and he pushes me pushes you like where do you put his hand on you like on my it had to be on this side i really don't remember but it was on this side somewhere okay so he slapped your right hand or left hand okay all right and he's he was arrested with dv battery against you selling me or just a pregnant person okay and how long ago was that uh he just got out not even a month ago okay all right. Uh, are you willing to do any statements for me? Is he getting arrested? From what you're gathering and giving me, yeah, it's going to be... Okay. Yeah. I'm fine with it. Okay. I just want him gone. Okay. Are you, are you going to do the DV paper and everything like that? Yeah. Okay. All right. Give me one second, all right? No, no, you don't want him gone. You want him gone, but you want him to serve time for what he did. He didn't learn his lesson in jail. She just said, yeah, he was in jail for putting paws on her. So he get out of jail and he's still putting paws on you. And he stole your car. You know, there was an argument over there by the park. And uh, he slaps her phone out of her hand. He pushes her. And then he takes her car. And she has to get flagged down by some white dude to, to save her or take her home. You know, that could have been dangerous. That is so dramatic. You know, and she pregnant at the same time. Come on now, y'all. Y'all need to teach y'all daughters how to make a police report when somebody putting paws on y'all. And that's another thing. Can we do a class 
what to say, how to say things when you're making a police record because I think people don't know. She's so nonchalant. I just want him gone. You don't want him to serve time for putting paws on you and slapping your phone and taking your car? No, I want you to get time for everything because you have to learn. And he has not learned his lesson yet. He doesn't have to take it to this extent. Like I said, he got two foots. The dude could have kept walking. Yeah. Who's phone and is this all his property? Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm just, I'm asking him. I'm asking him. What did I do, sir? Sure, what did I do? You know daddy, what, you what did I do? No, daddy? Don't turn man, okay? Really, Daddy? Yes, yes, If you keep turning, I'm going to drop you on the floor. You understand me? Pops, huh, so for real, bro? Huh? Don't stop. Look, 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 look at him. Look, he about to, he start, he about to start resisting. He about to, look at that wide back he got. He about to start resisting. You know what you did wrong. He about to start resisting. Y'all cannot put hands on women. You will not put hands on women, black women at that. Black women, y'all need to start speaking out and getting these niggas arrested left and right. If they even look at you wrong, call the cops. They should never put paws on you. Never slapping you out of your face. Never trying to intimidate you with a wide back manly behind to try to make you feel small or less than because you are a woman. That's all that is. And to take her car, now he want to act like he don't know what's going on and he want to start resisting from the cops. You, do, you need to submit. Learn how to submit to authority. Mama, what did I do? What the fuck? Hush your mouth. Hush your mouth. Stop cussing. Hush your mouth. So he, are, so you guys not just take me away from here. I didn't do nothing. I tried. Man, you could have been gone. Couldn't he have walked? Comment, let us know. Press one if he could have walked away from there. Okay, thank you. To get away from the situation. Well, you got to go now, buddy. Oh, cool. Whose phone is this? Please, that's the one she left in the car when she went. Oh! You see how he lie? You see how he lie? What you doing with her phone? What are you doing with her phone? Tell me, oh, that's the that's what she left in the car after he took her car. He took her phone because she didn't he didn't want her to call the cops. But guess what? Somebody else called the cops. People are watching you. And somebody else called the cops. She couldn't call the cops because he took her phone when he was putting paws on her. And when he took her car. And she was out there stranded. And somebody uh picked her up and they saw that and they called the cops. Mm-mm-mm. Man, oh man, look at this. Now he gonna lie to him about she left the phone. Like he's such a good Samaritan. And guess what? People in the comment section, they eating it up. They believe this black man over that black woman. You know, they think all black women are liars. Yeah, yeah. Inside the house. And look, she's going through my things. Hey, don't touch your stuff, okay? Don't touch my stuff. Come on now, what did I do? I'll let you know in a second. They about to give him a courtesy ride down to the precinct. Yeah, he get a courtesy ride, a ride for free. Ain't that nice? I'll let you know when we get in the car, okay? I'll let you know. But I am getting arrested. That's right now, guys. Just pay attention to him. We're not going to follow him around, okay? I'll let you know. Get in the car. He's so damn dramatic. You know what you did. Just submit to authority and stop talking back. All that back talk he got. 
cool, bro. Everything inside. Feet inside. <laughs> this girl, boy. I was trying to stay away from this girl, bro. And I'm All still right. getting in trouble. Okay, well, why you keep on being around her? Uh-uh. No, no, no. Now he want to blame it on a black woman because he can't control his emotion. You see, he's already emotional. He's not doing a rational thing, just being quiet and cooperating with authority. He going back, he flinching, he moving, he wiggling it all around. He's trying to talk his way out of this. No, nah, they about to give you a courtesy ride, brother. Well, all right, so right now you're being arrested for DV battery, okay? For DV battery, what? Yes. How? Where? Well, she's claiming you slapped her hand with Can you please tell her to show you any form of martial Ooh, anything, sir? Oh, he's so aggressive, y'all. I'm scared. Oh, he's so aggressive. Look at that. Girl, I'd be scared of that. That's a black cane right there. Why back back clang? Oh, I'd be so damn scared. Look at him, how he's so dramatic. Could you imagine you in a room by yourself with this monster right here? Girl, he, you know he gonna knock you out. Uh-huh, yeah. And he wanna lie, make it seem like he's an innocent one. Look at all this dramatics he doing. It doesn't matter. She's playing Sir, okay? I just, I just got out for this. I for this same, same charge, well, DV battery. Should, then you should have known not to. If but, you know the issues would become when you get together. The there's thing. no reason until you guys come back together. She came and got me. Well, she's claiming that you told her to pick you up. She came and got me, okay. sir. Right. Oh, why did you go with her? You a grown man. <laughs> why did you go with her if that's the case? Let's just take his line logic. If she, if you got in trouble with her before. You claim that she set you up before. She come pick you up. Why in the hell would you get in the car with the woman that you say set you up? That shit don't make sense. It ain't making sense, nigga. You know, if that's the case, <laughs> maybe you'll learn this time. Well, just to bring me all the way down here to get me in trouble again? Okay. Well, I can't prove that. I can't. I can't tell you. What, so what how can that. you guys prove that she, I hit her when I didn't okay. even touch this girl? Okay, well, uh uh, he lied. That's why he's so loud and emotional. You could tell when the niggas lie. They get so emotional when they be telling the truth. They be so calm. All this emotion and stuff. Nigga, you going back home? She's claiming she used soccer. Her. In the this hand. is a claim. Okay. Is this your card? Yes. Yeah, what? Yes. Okay. What did? Right. So the cigarette, the layers can't go with you. All right. I'll bring your bag. And please, everything like sir, that, okay? please tell me. I already told you why you're being arrested. Okay? But, but, what's the but, 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 Maybe he didn't know his daddy, you know, because they said that the man, the black canes that don't know how to submit to authority, they never had a daddy in the home. And that's why they can't uh, submit. That's what Jason Wildback said on Fox News and everybody went with that. So I'm just, I'm just, you know, reiterating his rhetoric. Mm. Say she isn't in the home. Okay. You have your day in court, okay? <laughs> what back. the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Let's take it from the top, y'all. Make sure y'all like this video. Do y'all like me doing more videos like this? Please press 15. If you want me to do more videos like this, comment, let us know. All right, let, let's take it from the top. Go on, bud. Go on today. All right, you have your ID on you? I just need, I just need to get all the information because, I mean, the way it called came out. Uh, I could give you my information, but really it's them you need to talk to. Okay, well, I mean, you're kind of part of it too, so she's advising you took her phone and car when you left. Hey, look where her car's at. It's right I don't know that I wasn't here. I just, I just showed up. I just showed up. All right? That's why I said you need to talk okay, to them. Okay, I'm going to talk to them once my partner gets here, but I'm out with you right now. Okay. All right? Now, no one's in trouble right now. I'm just trying to clarify all the information, okay? All I know is I'm grabbing my stuff out of the house, and they brought okay, so my stuff I'm to the door. So I'm, I'm outside. planning on leaving. Okay. That's all I wanted to do was leave. Okay. Do you have your... the situation so escalated. why didn't he leave? All you wanted to do was leave. Why you ain't gone? Okay, ta-da! Get the hell out of here. Pack your bags. You remember that song, y'all? Ding dong is the side of the da, da, da. He need, he needed to to die his ass out of there. He's still there. So anything like that, I was planning on leaving. And y'all know these niggas lie so much. They lie, lie, lie. He ain't doing nothing but lying. 
What happened? Oh. Mind if I You're ride good. this back yeah. You have your ID on you, though? Not on me. Is that your car? Whose car? Now, how you don't have your ID on you when you supposed to be going to the airport? Make it make sense. He talking about, I need somebody to take me to the airport. You're going to need your ID to get to the damn airport, nigga. Get your ID. That's her car. Okay. And she's inside the house. Okay. So why are we here? What's... We're here because she... I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna put everything on her. Like it's because she doesn't want to leave me alone. But yeah. she, she, she does her own thing. That's all it is. She does okay. her own thing. So if you're gonna do your own thing, then leave me alone. Okay. She should be. That's inside. all it is. She does her own thing. What are you talking about? She does her own thing. If she gonna do her own thing, then leave me alone. It sounds like homegirl living her life and not worry about no nigga, and he mad. Because she's probably entertaining other men. That's what it sounded like. Because he said, if you're going to do your own thing, leave him alone. She's, mm. Leave me alone. Okay, but what happened? Why, why are we getting called? I don't What's know why issue? she called or whoever called. I don't know why they called. Who's Betty? Inside the house. Is that your girlfriend? Whatever. She, she's not my girlfriend. Okay, well, she's wait, not my girlfriend. Five, ten minutes ago, she was your girlfriend. Before no. Before all this. Okay. Who she's is she to you? She's the mother of my child, which my child is in there. Okay. All right, so what were you guys doing over over on Palm Harbor? She was taking me to the park. Okay. You guys live together? I'm, I'm here on vacation. Where are you I'm, from? I'm Orlando area. I'm okay. here because she brought me here with her parents. Okay. That's all. And you went. Okay, okay, I'm going to ask y'all a question. When she invited him with her parents, could he have denied and say, no, I don't want to go because you set me up before? Press five if he could have said, no, I'm not going nowhere with you when you set me up before. He could have did that, but he did not. Because he know he lying. Just to visit the kids? Yeah, just to visit the kids. Okay, so what are you guys doing over there? We, we was trying to talk. Okay, did you two? And then I just, I left. If you're going to visit the kids, you know you need to visit the kids uh, by yourself. You don't need her to visit your damn kids. You visit your kids on your own terms. But why would you even go anywhere with her to be stuck on her time? That don't make sense. You a whole grown man out here. You got family. You got friends. You got to find how to do you. That don't make sense. Okay. Just were you guys outside the vehicle at the time or were yes, you inside? outside the vehicle. Okay. Is there something that she said that pissed you off and you decided to just come over here and... Get your stuff and leave. It's been it's been all all morning since yesterday. We, we, we. He know he does not supposed to be smoking. He he violating everything. But guess what? He is lawlessness. He has no respect for authority or nobody else. He gonna do what he want to do. That's what that says. We came to the conclusion. We talked it out. Okay. But that's not working. So. The best thing for me to do is get from around. That's okay. all it is. I'm waiting out the whole time. My stuff is out here waiting on them to take me back to Orlando. Okay. Uh, uh, that's where you wrong. Don't wait on nobody. You a grown man. You just got finished saying you got a tour with these people. Find your way home, buddy. Get a, a lift. Go get an Uber. And I know he's not going anywhere without no damn money. Was he dependent on a baby mama for financial aid? Come on now. And what is it? She cut you off and she said she ain't giving you no more money? Can anybody with common sense? No. Get a, a Uber and live. Why would you even want anything from them at this point? He's full of excuses. He takes no accountability and he depends on everybody else. He's a big old baby. He not. He's a grown man, but his behavior... I guess there's something else going on, right? I don't, I don't know. I haven't talked to her. We got very vague information. All we have is that you guys got into an argument, you took her car, and came back here. That's all we have. So that's why I'm trying to clarify everything. Was anything physical? You see, he ain't say nothing when he said you took her car. He ain't stop him. And he's definitely not looking at the police while he's talking. He's always looking on the side. What's up with that? No. Just verbal? Verbal. Verbal? Okay. All right, you have a valid driver's license out of uh, Florida? No. Okay. Did you say you took the car? I did not take her car. How'd you get back here? She brought me back here. Okay, so you guys were in the car. Oh, he's such a liar. He's such a liar. <laughs> they got camera footage of you, buddy. She got there from that white dude that picked her up. He drove there with her car. He's such a liar. He's such a liar. Yes. 
So why is she claiming that you took the car and left? She's, she's, she's doing this just to get me roped off or in trouble, whatever the case may be. Okay. I don't know. What's your first but name, I just know I am here and my stuff is right there. Inside the car? No, my stuff is right here. Oh, in that right blue bag right there? Blue okay. bag, the floor, the laptop. What's your first name, man? She still hasn't brought me back my, uh, my, uh, my, uh, laptop or any, my, uh, chargers or anything. Okay. What's your, what's your first A -L -P. name? ALP. 26. So you have no driver's license, no idea whatsoever? Not, not on me. I didn't right. bring them with Do you have like an identification card? Like, what, what do you have? Are you allowed to drive? No. Okay. Not, you're not going to get trouble. I'm just trying to figure it out. Um, All I was trying to do was get away. Okay. That's it. What was she, what like was she was arguing with you about? Was she wanting to get back together or? I don't know what she wanted to argue about. She doesn't say anything, but just wakes up mad at me. Okay. So All if right. she waking up mad at me, what will... Child, he's such a damn liar. He want to know what was the conversation like when y'all went to the damn park. Is he stuck on stupid? He talking about when she wakes up, she's mad at me. Child, we're not talking about when y'all woke up. We're talking about at the damn park. What was the conversation that led to the escalation? I don't know. I don't know what she yelling about. Nigga, you know, because you up here lying. What am I supposed to do besides stay away from her? And okay. that's all I was trying to do was stay away from her. So you basically you two drove over to the park over there on Palmer. We Palm drove over to the park, we drove back, and, and I decided to grab all my things. Okay. Her parents was here, everybody. They seen everything. Okay. Oh God. So his story, they drove to the park, they drove back, and he just got his bag and he just wanna go home. Do y'all believe these lying ass niggas? Huh? Press five if you believe this lying ass nigga. Okay? Ain't nobody take believing him. They always lie. This is typical. You guys were having a talk over there at the park? Yes. We were supposed to. Okay. And then you guys... I don't, I don't want to be yeah. around here. Okay. And you guys had just some disagreement and whatever was going on that's all it was okay and then you just you came you guys came back here i just i just want to get away from okay. here i just want to get away from how her. are you able to get back because obviously you don't i, I put don't know you. how I'm, they're supposed to be taking me back okay. they're supposed to you see that right you, I, I understand you, you see just, that right yeah, just not a letter. <laughs> they're supposed to be the ones taking me back do you have but a, they choose, card ID card they're choosing not to ID, nigga why would you want to get in the car with them when y'all already got into it? Does that make sense? Ain't no way I'm going to put my grown ass in another toxic situation where we already know the, the energy is bad. No. He, he got to be slow. Why would you want to wait around and catch a ride with them? He got to be broke. Broke and slow. Get you an Uber and Lyft and go ahead about your business. I wouldn't want nothing from them. They couldn't even, they couldn't offer me shit. I'm sorry. If, if, but he's lying. This man is a liar. I can see it. I can sniff niggas like him out. He's lying. They're choosing not to. Okay. They're choosing to leave me stranded over here. Do you have When they were the ones who brought me here. Do you have money for you Uber? I don't have nothing. They yeah. brought me here. I understand. Do you have How are you a grown man? You don't have money for an Uber. You don't have your ID. You don't have no identification card. Did you wash your ass, nigga? Did you, did you have soap? Do you got a towel? He named, he got a laptop, but he ain't named, he got soap and towel. I don't believe he washing his ass. Um, this is ridiculous. You too grown. You a grown man. How you leave the house without no money? Who does that as a grown man? You a whole father out here. How you leave the house without any money, depending on your baby mama to take care of you, depending on your baby mama to feed you, depending on your baby mama for everything. How you gonna eat? You don't got no money? Depending on the baby mama. Y'all black women, y'all doing too much for these niggas at this point. Come on now. Friends that could possibly come pick you I up? I have nothing, sir. Okay. All I had was I thought was them. And you see how he expresses himself. He's very dramatic. He gets angry very fast. You can tell. He gets annoyed very fast. This is authority. The last thing I'm going to do is be all over dramatic and talk to them crazy. He's talking to them crazy like they slow. 
I'm telling you, sir, and all this, you talk to them like you got some common sense. You don't have to do all this with your big hand movement and stuff like that. You can just talk to people like you civilized. You could tell he's lying. That's why he got to over-exaggerate. That's why he have to over-dramatics to try to convince somebody he's being truthful. Now, I will tell you, I looked in the comment section, a lot of mother suckers, they did believe him. I think there was, you know, I ain't going to tell you what group it was, but. Hmm. They brought me here. Okay. After that, I don't have nothing. I don't have no money. I don't have no ID. I don't have no, I, the clothes that I got, I don't know why she's even giving them to me, but she's the one who got them for me. I have nothing. Okay. I came here for my. Oh my God. That's embarrassing. He don't got no clothes. She bought him the clothes. Y'all doing too much. She bought, she, she brought, let me just shut the hell up. Mm. For my kids, to see my kids. Okay. How, what, how old are your kids? 26, thank you. Oh, two in a few months, man. Okay. Five yeah. months at the most. Okay. So you have obviously no way of getting back. Obviously, they're probably not going to take you back. So what's the plan, obviously, from can, now? Can you get them to take me back? Cause they, I can't they force brought... them. I can't force them to take you back. That's the whole thing. But they brought me here. I, I, they I, brought I, me I all the way that. from Orlando to Palm so, Coast. Talk to so. me about what happened, man. I, I don't have nothing to say about what happened because I feel like I am in the right for coming to grab my to things. I just I just wanted to grab my things and go. Go Let back go to, talk to, to where I'm yeah, from. Yeah, That's all it is, man. All right, just sit tight right there. We're just going to talk about things and then we're going to figure things out, okay? So, yeah. She, she, she lives in one Yep. He's been arrested before for, I guess, you need to have her for mm -hmm. hitting her. Um, I can't hear her. I'm going to warn So. I think it's going to be it. So. Let's see. I can't hear her. I don't see any marks on Go back. She got a right for the guy. Huh, huh. He's, he's saying that they both go back. I don't so. know what she's saying. She got to get a right from somebody. Who's the guy? Uh, some person she flagged down. Does he have, do you have any information? I mean, it's all on the call, man. Just by what she said. Let me see. I know nothing about that. I don't know why she's even saying anything like that. Okay, so you guys drove there. You guys drove back drove together. Back. Okay, and you guys been here since. We've been here since, and I've been out here since. Okay, has, trying to what figure about out how I'm gonna get away from you. Okay, but you never put your hands on I her. Never you never put my hands on her. I've never, never touched her. You never nothing, slapped the phone out of her hand or anything like, like that. that. No? Nothing like that. Okay, all right. Where's all this, toward? all this extra thing is just. He sound like he got an accent. He from the islands, don't he? Did y'all hear that accent? To get me in the form of the trouble, that's all it is. But I, I, I promise you, I told, I told her. Look, just take me back to the house so I can get my things and leave. Okay. Her parents come out here. Now, why would you want somebody to take you anywhere if they're going to get you in trouble with the cops? That don't make no bit of sense. He said uh, she's trying to set him up. So why would you even want, I wouldn't want nothing from her. Why would you want to ride from her? Uh-uh. You better off walking. Riled up. Yeah. You mean riled up like I'm, like I'm the one who did anything wrong to her. But her, her mother knows me. Her mother knows me. She knows how I am. She knows everything about me. I didn't touch this girl. I didn't say nothing wrong to this girl. All I was doing was trying to get my things so I could leave quietly. Yeah. It don't matter where I'm going. If I'm in the streets, I'm in the streets. But my goal is to get back to Orlando. Okay. Are you still not want to talk to me? I don't. I don't want to talk to nothing that has to do with her well, because we're here that's small. Your crime. I'm trying to figure out. See, he's advising you didn't. You didn't take any phone or anything. What? What? But we're here to investigate the crime. So, so did anything physical occur? I'm at their house. I'm I'm trying to leave. Okay, I hear you, but, but besides the point, we're here to investigate what happened. The reason why we got called and 911 is not here, okay? Then, sir, please talk to them. I have talked to them. That's why I want to talk to you. Talk to me, please, sir. Okay, please I, this I isn't, this is the first time you said you want to talk to me. This isn't getting me away from here. Okay. This is the thing. I, 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 I want to... I'm you gonna they gonna put you in a cop car and they're gonna take you away from here and he got what he begged for i want to be away from here all he cares about himself he is selfish and take me away from here 
Take me away from here. That's all he's doing. Is it going to get me away from here? Then I don't want to talk about it. He's so rude to the authority. They're trying to figure out what happened instead of being calm and collective. He's outrageous, over-emotional, and just doing the most. Doing the most. But you you going to get what you're begging for. They're going to take you far, far away from there to uh to the damn courthouse. I'm trying to figure out if you want to talk to me. the first time you said you don't want to talk to me. If you don't want to talk to me, that's perfectly fine. It's constitutional, right? I just have to convey something to one person. Hey, he already told me he did. He already asked him his questions. How you doing, sir? Pretty good. Can, are you, were you here this time when they were here and stuff like that? Um, yeah, my daughter, was she didn't know that I rode there, but he was just testing me. Put a hard words in the house and just go now. Yeah. There's no, no woman here. Really? Gotcha. I mean, How did he get here? Did you pick him up and brought him here? I brought him here, yes, because he asked me to. Okay. And then when was that yesterday? No, it was like a couple of weeks. But the only reason I brought him down here was because my parents were trying to get him a place to stay until he found his home. Because like I said, he just got out of jail. Okay, for, for what? Uh, domestic violence. He's actually on probation. He's not supposed to be doing any of this because it's a violation, including smoking. Okay. All right. Um, did he touch you at, all at any point? Touch? Like, did, like, did he hit you or anything? Yeah, he slapped my phone under my hand and pushed me when I tried to get... He has my phone. Okay. And my car keys. Okay. All right, who'd you get the ride and from? she showed... The, uh, it was... I didn't even get his name. It was a white guy. He just stopped when I flagged him down. And where were you guys at? The park over there I across the bridge? Man, and she showed tell the truth. He had her phone and, um... Uh, he had uh, her keys right in his pockets, in his damn pockets. What was her phone doing in, her, in the pockets? Talking about she left the, her phone in the car. That's her car. So why are you picking up her phone and putting it in your pocket, nigga? That don't make sense. Why, if she left her phone in her car, why do you pick it up and put it in your pocket? He's a liar. Comment, let us know what you guys think about this. Be careful with these black kings out here. Bye.